a bit of rain in the earth. Uh, there's also blue sky and sunshine. But today I'm going to attempt to go on the uh, Buckle Etif Moor, which is uh, two Munro's, Stop Jarag and Stop Nebroiga. So this is the car park where uh, the users started this walk from, but I've uh, took some of the uh, the walk across to the normal start. So I started at the other car park to take away the last bit of a drag across after you finish the walk. I ain't walking too far after I finish my climbs. So <laughs> there's something clear for now. Uh, hopefully it stays that way. A bit of blue sky hanging over the top as you can see. So let's cross this bridge. Well, the rain has stopped now, so Pretty good. It's probably take me about an hour or so to get to the Athos Summit, I think. So we'll come to a fork in the road to the left. That takes you to the uh, the curved ridge, but we are going right on the somewhat easier path. If you could call it the tourist path, I guess. But yeah, we're going to basically go up, uh, get to the ridge and then take a, a left to our first summit, Stop Jarag. Just looking back the way I've come. The main ascent. Just made my way across the stream on wet rock. My boots are not the best on wet rock. They're a bit treacherous. Great in bogs, but wet rock not so great. Just taking a bit of a reaver. Guess you're right, right up this. Still got a ways to go. Still spitting a little bit. I can see blue sky around. So I'm hopeful it's just a little passing shower. Talking about the welcome. See you down to the 82. Still blue sky around and this rain seems to be persisting just for me. Uh, just looking back, just looking back the way I came. That uh, rain seems to be blowing over thankfully. Got my full waterproof on down from where I started, the 82. So it's a, it's a black water reservoir. Blue sky coming over my top, my first number one uh, stop. Derek. Well, the sun's out now. A lot of contrast to about five minutes ago. I think uh, putting my waterproof leggings on did the trick. Looking down to the climb I've done. It's brightening up nicely now. Still got a little ways to go. But sunshine. Especially over the top of the first one. Just seen the first person since I left the car park. So uh, there are two people around. Almost at the ridge now. Just looking back down and sunny climb I've just done. We have just that bit to go. So I can back up through the views. Bit of a scramble that next little bit. Looks like the summit's clear, blue sky. The ridge is just there thankfully. Almost there. Oh, 
me needed to be like. So I guess right right up. Clear views, blue sky. We're looking towards my second summit. Stopping the brogue. Great views all around. It's like get some clear tops today. Hopefully. Also the top. Stop Jerk. Now getting the views into Granite Moor. Just met a, a couple and they've just built a curve ridge and basically saying I've uh, we'll have this mountain to myself. Nobody around. Wow. See for miles. Beautiful. See the forest over yonder. Views off. Stop Jeddak. Pretty clear today. Not much wind. It's pretty, pretty exposed on here. See the miles. Beautiful. See over into Glencoe, over there. Still plenty of sunshine and blue sky around. It's raining a little bit on top of here. So I'm going to move on to my other summit. It's not stopping at Brogger. Final views. Clearing up again now. Just heading back the way we came now. And as we go to the second number of uh, stopping the brogue. Yeah, the weather weather is very changeable today. It's like it's sun, rain, rain mist now approaching where we uh, got to the ridge. Head up towards there. Across. So I'll stop in the car here. Just looking down where I climbed up earlier. See the A82 down below. So we make our way over to. Munro. See uh, Ben Nevis over there. Looks as though it's a bit of cloud hanging on the top of it. See the Dean Yan Pian was last August. Three sisters of Glencoe. It's going to be headed towards this top. Back on Stop Jerek, it's in the sun. Sun all around, isn't it? Well, we can see some rain mist in the, in the distance. Let's hope it stays in the distance. Just looking back where I came. I keep stop looking back, to be honest. Stop, stop. 
checking footage and checking the views in. Brilliant. That mountain's pretty much to myself as well. So I'll climb this uh, number on top. See a bit of rain mist around. Looks like the sun poking through the clouds. We're okay for you for now. Use up a more. Got a little bit to go now. For this uh, number on top. It's worth the top of that. Number on top. The 360s are actually quite glorious around here. Dropping down off this mum roll top to make my way to stop the Bruyger. Looks like it's gonna have some good views off there as well. And uh, I can see my path down just over there. I've done that mum roll. Yeah, it's okay. Gorgeous views. You can see, you can see down into Glenetti where the Skyfall location was. That's for some of the film the footage. This uh, drop down this uh, mum road top isn't uh, too technical. It's quite quite easy, really. It's great. Just a step. That's it, really. Just looking back, off where I've dropped, dropped off. Looking to Glenetive. Top. You can see where my path down the mountain is just in the dip between the two lumps. So I'm going to try and get up there for the final one row. Bit of ale now. As we pass down, I've just got to get up this last one row. Hopefully, it's just a passing thing, this ale. Well, the ale seems to have stopped for now. Sunshine over there. Look over the other side. You can see the rain mist. It's where I'll be heading later. And there uh, is my pass down after I've been up here. On my way to stop Nebroya. I've sort of been through an ale stone. Job I get kept me uh, not with leggings on. It's still raining a little bit. Just these guys do this top. I don't think I'll be hanging around so long on the top. And then make my way back to the car. Here we are, second summit. Second of a row anyway. Flag is in. And hailstones. I don't think I'll be hanging around here long, but here we are. Stopping it. Oh, wrong. Not much views off stop. Nebrog. It was clear up until about 10 15 minutes ago. The weather changes quite rapidly here. I'm gonna get off down the mountain now. It's a bit grim now. Uh, the weather's moved in pretty rapidly. But the good thing is, I'm, I know I'm just retracing my steps now back to the path down. The wind and hail is driving across now. But Fairly close to me, uh, path. We're dropping down into the valley. The path down into the valley, up and off the mountain. It's a bit of um, sun over there, so hopefully that comes in. Before I get back to the car, it'll dry, up, dry me off a bit, although I am in full waterproof. Still don't keep you 100% dry. It's better than nothing. And it keeps, they keep you warm. Drop off now again, yeah. down into the valley. Just making my way down the path into the valley now. Got a, a ways to go. It looks like the weather's brightening up over yonder. Drop, drop quite a lot now. Still raining a bit, but it's slackened off slightly. Stuck my 
brighter towards where I'm heading. Got a little ways to go, you can see the path on the way down. I'm basically going to be skirting along the side of that like, river or stream. Just dropped uh, through a bit of a technical section. Well, it would be alright if it was dry, but because uh, it's wet, some of this water is basically going straight across the path. Uh, my boots are not the best on wet rock, so yeah, there's been a bit, a bit, a bit of fun, I'd say, over the last five minutes. I'll be happy when I get down to that path I can see just across. So basically, looking back, you can see the waterfall. I basically uh, just uh, slid down mostly on my ass down the side of there, because, as I say, my boots just don't sit on wet rock really well. Well, with all this rain, it's flooding down, there's plenty of waterfalls around. In fact, the path is a waterfall in places. <laughs> so that's where I've just dropped down. Pretty much down the side of the waterfall, I think. Well, certainly in places. And uh, I'm now almost in the valley. And yes, it's still raining. Oh, oh I have to get across the river. Oh, No point trying to go across rocks, I think they'll be too, too slippy. Uh, it doesn't look that deep, as long as it doesn't come over the, the ankles, I'm fine. Just <laughs> went straight across it. I think it was just not deep enough to go over my boots, which I didn't manage to fall in. You seem to have much luck with the Glencoe. Oh, it seems to <laughs> rain on the second half of my walk. Yeah. Looking behind me, <coughs> mountains have kind of cleared up where it was. Still raining a little bit, not as bad as it was. It's going to be just over ten and a half miles in total. Uh, the buckle more, 3,900 feet of ascent. Uh, stop of Jedi and stop the broker. 